Hi there, I'm Kim Berkeley, one of the authors of the Speaking Out About Self-Injury blog over on Healthy Place, and today I wanted to talk about self-harm and depression. In particular, I want to talk about coping with these things while you have family over. Now, it's no secret that for most of us, uh, the holidays can be a really fun time, but also a really stressful time. Um, and if you're dealing with something as potentially serious and personal as self-harm and or depression, it can be extra tough. Now, if your friends or family that are over are aware of the situation and they're supportive, you know, you're open with them about it, then this can be a really great time to ask just for a little extra support or understanding. Um, it, during a time like this, it's great to have as much support as you can. So if you're lucky enough to talk about that with them, then, you know, this is a good time to do it. For the rest of us, uh, who may not be so lucky, um, maybe your relatives know but are not fully understanding or fully accepting of your situation, or maybe they don't know and you're not ready to talk about it. Um, there are some other things that you can do without necessarily having to discuss it outright that can help you get through the season. Um, the first major thing is to set boundaries. Uh, which I know this can be really tough during the holidays because everyone seems to have this expectation of you're supposed to want to spend all the time that you can together and be social and be merry and be well and that can be really hard when you might be feeling even worse than usual. Um, so the one of the most important things I can think of to help during this time is just to set those boundaries and say yes I'm going to spend time with you but I also am going to take time for myself. It might be an hour, it might be a couple hours, um, as regularly as possible is the main thing. Uh, the other thing is to try not to dive into the opposite end of the spectrum and isolate yourself. Um, I know I used to daydream sometimes about hiding away in a log cabin throughout the season and coming back when everyone had gone home. Um, even if you get along with everybody, even if you have a generally good relationship with your relatives, uh, it can be it can be a tough time if you're if you don't want to socialize every minute of the day. But that being said, it is important to spend some time with someone this season. The final thing is just uh, pretty applicable across the year, but especially right now, self care is really important. Um, this will look different to different people, but aside from the basics, you know, hygiene, take a bath or a shower every day, brush your teeth, eat something good for you, um, just, you know, make, make time to do things that make you happy. Um, even if you're, you can't feel that right now, just going through the motions a lot of the time can help alleviate some of the negative emotions, even if you're not feeling the positive ones yet. Thank you so much for watching. I hope this video helped. Uh, if you have any questions, comments, concerns, etc., as always, please leave a comment on the blog and I or my co-author will get back to you as soon as we can. Otherwise, I hope you have a very happy holiday season, and if you don't celebrate any holidays, I hope you have a wonderful winter. Thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you in the next video. Bye.